guys, welcome back to Carlisle Soups 808, covering all things Superman related. So yeah, yesterday on the Inside of You podcast with Michael Rosenbaum, who we all know was uh, Lex Luthor on the hit TV series Smallville in the early 2000s, he has a, a podcast called Inside of You, and uh, yesterday, June 13th, 2023, he interviewed uh, the uh, new head of DC, James Gunn, who he's personal friends with. And yeah, do you remember uh, a little bit of time ago I did um, a video, you might not remember, but a video on uh, Michael Rosenbaum's views on potentially Jesse Eisenberg's Le Lex Luthor, and now we had a bit of a passive-aggressive little dig at the guy? Yeah, I do. I was just like, huh? I didn't want to be like anyone else. I just, you know, um, I just wanted to be around. And that's how I still today believe Lex Luthor should be played. He should be the brilliant, stoic, conniving, manipulative, but genius that doesn't have to go crazy and act like the Joker and oh things like God. that. Oh! Well, here comes another, and it seems James Gunn shares his thoughts and feelings. And also, James Gunn seems to think that Michael Rosenbaum was the best Lex Luthor ever. I agree, James. Let's listen to him. Sure. Um, let me ask you this. Or just promise that, or will the Lex Luthor character, there'll be a Lex Luthor, right? Finn, isn't that already known? Yeah, they think everybody thinks there's a Lex Luthor out there, but I've never said there was a Lex Luthor in there. All right, so if there were a Lex Luthor. If there were a Lex Luthor, okay. If there were a Lex Luthor in this movie, and there's a lot of other villains, so it may not be Lex Luthor. You are the best Lex. Let's admit it. We know you're the best Lex. Come on, you're being funny. I'm not being funny. You're definitely the best Lex. Really? Definitely. But not right for your movie. <laughs> not right for my, not my... I didn't say there was even a Lex in the movie. So. I know, but if there were a Lex Luthor, promise me this. Uh-huh. You'll, he'll be, he'll have gravitas or he'll have uh he'll have a, he'll, he'll be Lex Luthor. He won't be a, a playing, playing Lex Luthor, but he's more acting like this character or this or goofy or crazy. He's going to be something that's grounded and real. I know you, I'm sure that's everything's grounded and real. Yeah. Yeah. Everything's right. Grounded and real. Because I'm not saying anybody's done that. I'm just saying that, that, you know, maybe if somebody's done that, maybe, maybe that's happened. But, yeah. Anyway, we'll continue <clears throat> on. Uh, That's a burn. Problems up here. Mm. Mm. Uh, the, mm, the problem of, of evil in the world. Mm. 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 And I am... <laughs> no. I, um, no, what am I? I? What was I saying? It's paradoxical. And, um... <laughs> And guys, if you enjoyed this video, I'll put a card in the corner here for more James Gunn comments in his interview with Michael Rosenbaum on Superman Legacy, the audition process, and the possible inclusion of Crypto the Superdog. So check that video out. Also, guys, if you like content like this, as always, give us that like if you haven't already. It really helps out the channel. And make sure you are subscribed so you don't miss out on any future Superman-related content. With that said, catch you in the next one.